hello there welcome into my channel sage sunset healing tarot welcome in libra we're going to do some messages for you for your next seven days ahead libra the air sign one that speaks how they feel and acts in alignment with that <coughs> I feel like some of you could be uh, maybe alone, standing alone right now, Libra. Uh, meaning that <coughs> maybe you're not refu receiving love right now. We, we see water sign here. Tens of Pisces, Scorpio. We have fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We have earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I feel like some of you are focusing or wanting to focus or trying to focus on evaluating yourself and also, you know, money, to have, um, making your own money, creating your own source of income here with the seven of pentacles. And then I have some of you are definitely uh, separated from love right now with the four of cups energy. You may be receiving offers of love, but you're not really accepting them with the nine of one's energy i feel like uh, you're maybe watching looking out for something waiting to see if this offer is going to come into you you're maybe suspicious of offers coming into you uh, maybe already on the defense ready to, ready to pick out the pieces that are are not that that does not sit well with you with any offering that's coming toward you with the nine of one's energy Your past energy here is the Nine of Cups. So I feel like maybe you're moving from being happy alone, being happy by yourself. Um, this is water energy as well, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. So you could be moving away from a person, Libra, that has that um, those signs within their charts. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, water elements here. Some of you are moving away from this water energy. Some of you may want to be moving back to this energy, reconnecting with this person. Um, this person may want to come back and reconnect with you. I'm feeling fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius once more. But this fire energy could also talk about your emotional state, your thought patterns, your beliefs, what, you, what you're passionate about, the things that you desire to have for yourself. This can also be a person that's coming into you, but it's also about feelings, emotions, and energy that you have within yourself, maybe to move away from a situation that you feel is no longer serving you. I feel like you feel that this energy here, the, the Nine of Cups, was getting high off of your energy, as if getting drunk, as if being happy, I can't explain the energy, but you know when someone is always intoxicated, they always seem to be happy. Um, and I feel it is alcohol, drinking with the Nine of Cups energy. And so I feel like maybe um, as if they, they weren't, you weren't able to get into their emotional space because this sense of intoxication like it keeps them from connecting so maybe for some of you that's why you are moving away Re like realizing your value and moving away from a connection that's not serving you libra hmm. so in the future we have the knight of wands and that is someone leaving migrating so we have two cards of movement here for you leaving migrating this could be you are the this could be you moving or the person that you're dealing with. This can also be for some of you who are not affiliated right now with a relationship. This can be moving away from a business or so it's not necessarily a romantic relationship, a business connection, a friendship that's not good for you. Moving toward moving toward this energy too for some people. And um, I feel maybe someone wants to come back into you. Hmm. <laughs> I do feel like someone wants to come back into your world. They want to return. 
but i feel like you want a new beginning i feel like you want financial independence and stability we have the sun card at the bottom of the deck which for me is talking about being successful so i feel like you'll be successful in your endeavors so let us clarify some more for you libra what is the nine of cups energy So what I'm getting, Libra, is that the Nine of Cups energy that you're leaving behind is it's clarified by the Judgment card. So I'm feeling that it's something that was destined to happen. That this breakup or this are you moving away from this connection was aligned because I feel like it's not. It's always just not been for you. I feel like there's there's there wasn't a place for you in someone's emotional field you know as if they had i i don't see the devil energy out here but is it, it is as if they had some kind of other love or joy and that as i said it could be alcoholism we have the ten of swords energy which feels like being in a drunken state but i do feel like with the judgment card and the ten of swords this person is about to realize that gets a rude awakening Okay, so that's your past energy. I feel like you stood up for yourself here. You walked away. You ended something with the death card and the knight of swords. Because the knight of swords is destructive energy or really standing up for yourself, being assertive. The swords energy is your energy that is air sign, being direct, speaking how you feel. I feel like cutting off a connection with with a water sign possibly because we do have the king of cups here. So this could be someone that you have a family with. And I feel like they probably weren't stepping up to the plate enough for you. It's as if they you're there and they appreciate that you're there. But there's something else in the way. As if they have another source of happiness that they depend upon heavily so they're about to get a rude awakening maybe after you leave with the judgment card they're about to wake up and really open their eyes maybe that's why they're trying to come back into your life no we have the death card here so i do feel like the connection has moved on moved ended or it is you that with the knight of swords energy libra i feel like it is you that has definitely moved on from a connection that's not serving you Let us clarify the outcome for you, which is the Knight of Wands. Oh my gosh, Arista, now we have the Three of Cups to define or to clarify the Knight of Cups energy. The Three of Cups is joy and celebration, happiness, reuniting, being happy, manifesting happiness around you. And this can be very much in love. And we have the Cups energy again for you, Libra. So I feel like you definitely could be dealing with a water sign that could want to come back and have a re, -re and reunite with you. I feel like they feel they're attracted to you they feel compelled to come back around toward you and maybe this is after they have that rude awakening okay so standing i feel like you were standing up for yourself this person now realizes what it is that they want and maybe possibly coming back in to claim that claim you On the bottom of the deck, we have the Tower card. 
it could be an ending to an ending to the way that this person treated you in the past it is as if you decided to wipe this the slate clean both of you and start afresh so completely demolishing the way that your relationship was in the past and coming in with something brand new something to celebrate here some of you could have children or could be pregnant or could be wanting to get pregnant some of you could be deciding to just completely end the relationship and not look back with the tower energy let us now clarify what you're currently facing dealing with libra Alright, so what I'm getting for the Six of Wands energy, I do feel like moving on. You're going to be single for some of you or you're already single, working on your business, focusing on your business. Um, I feel like you could be moving into moving back into the connection with the water sign here because we have the ace of cups on the bottom of the deck maybe they're coming into you libra offering you love and affection offering you new life joy happiness prosperity this is what they're saying to you they're offering this to you but the truth is i barely see your energy here except that maybe something hurt you in the past betrayal disappointments and me and i feel like you stood up for yourself and that's mainly where i'm seeing your energy but i feel like someone is thinking about how to come back into you as if they want this happy new beginning with you any other messages for libra any other messages for libra please Information messages for this sign of Libra. What's going on with the Libra's energy? Libra energy. Any messages for Libra, please? Any other messages? Any other messages? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hmm. So we have the Tower card repeated. Some of you have definitely walked away. I know I keep repeating that. Ended a relationship possibly with a water sign. I feel earth energy, earth sign. So that's Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. This is your energy that I asked for. And we got the Page of Swords. Another Libran energy. So I feel like you're definitely take, standing up for yourself. Because the Page of Swords energy is standing in authority being diplomatic speaking up this is also my gone with the wind fabulous card and so i feel like if so if you've moved on from this connection you're going to be looking good single you're going to be handling your business focusing on your dreams looking good and standing up for yourself like you've always been we have the high priestess card here so some of you are very um intuitive too you, trusting in your intuition when something is not right trusting um or, or, or taking action for your highest good because you have that sense of connection with your highest good some of you are your highest self some of you could also be spiritual people um like you have a little uh, um you have some spiritual gifts about you some spiritual inclin inclinations and that could really be coming through your intuition Seeing the red flags and trusting your own judgment. Knowing when and how to stand up for yourself, Libra. And putting things behind you, ending things that are, would literally stop you from progressing into really manifesting a love or the life that you desire. Any other messages for Libra? We have the six of wands repeated here. Any other messages for Libra? Any other messages for Libra for this week? 
Libra in love, Libra in business, Libra home, Libra's energy. Hmm. New beginnings with the Ten of Pentacles. This is a new sense of self, new value. This is new money, new energy, good energy. This is gifts, surprises coming into you here with the Ten of Pentacles. We have the ace of swords once again i love that you're coming out so something is happening swiftly i feel like you're standing up for yourself and you're speaking it speaking out what it is that you want i feel like you're actually manifesting a life that you desire you're taking action and moving toward what it is that you want some of you are some some of you could be receiving messages from this person like they could be texting you or you could be texting out to a person maybe this person is from your past i feel like your text message could be really ending the relationship completely I, I i feel like that is what if you are the one that is texting if the person is one that's texting you i feel like they could be sending you messages of love and affection but i do feel like if you are the one sending the messages it's more about ultimatums what it is that you want out of a relationship you know that kind of energy all right libra i'm gonna leave your reading here it's been a very uh insightful reading thank you so much for being here i do hope you find messages in this reading that are able to help guide you along your journey consider supporting my channel subscribe thank you so much like and share with those that you love and remember libra that you can be do have everything and anything in this world that you desire because you are all and all is within you much love take care bye thank you so much for watching subscribe like and share with those that you love and i'll catch you in the next one